Hey Aries, welcome to 2021 February 2021 messages and advice. Now, welcome and <laughs> what can I say? Like when I was shuffling your cards, I like felt so much like intense energies coming through. <sighs> yeah, um, I've already pre-shuffled your cards because I just think it's like way faster. But if you would like me to shuffle on camera, just let me know. So yeah, let's just dive in. You got the Two of Swords in reverse, guys. The Hanged Men in reverse. The Four of Cups. Yeah, this was, yeah, this was maybe the energy I was feeling, honestly. The Ten of Pentacles. Wow, the Three of Cups. It's beautiful. The ten, the Tower. Ooh. The Seven of Swords. Don't worry, guys. And you got the Knight of Cups. Okay, I'm first starting with these here, and then I will go to your other tarot. Yeah, first of all, guys, I'm just gonna put this up, okay? Put this out there. In February 2021, you're gonna get an epiphany, okay? A realization, um, a revelation, really. Something is going to be shown to you you're gonna gain some kind of clarity which is definitely going to come sudden unexpected and it's about another person it's about a, a man okay don't be scared it doesn't have to be anything too serious okay this is just the energies coming through here it could be you know from your significant other or it can also be just from a family member it really depends okay or it depends but regardless, this is going to free you on so many levels, okay? I feel like this is something which um, which you really struggled with, okay? You may not even know right now what it is, but it will open up to you in February. And I'm seeing that it's something that you, you know, you wasted a lot of mental, you know, energy to. But you're gonna... Like something is coming into the light, okay? You're gonna know something. Maybe, for instance, there is like someone who did something and you're gonna know it. You're gonna, someone is gonna tell you or you're gonna just, somehow it's gonna be exposed, okay? Don't worry, okay? It doesn't have to be something too bad. Um, but it really depends on you. But no matter what it is, guys, you're gonna, like, this is going to be a very, this is something that had to happen. And it's going, it's definitely going to bring a lot of joy into your life, okay? Like with the Three of Cups, guys, and the Ten of Pentacles, that's incredible. Yeah, it's going to bring a lot of, like, firm foundations and also um, a lot of, like, harvest, I'm feeling. Like, for instance, when it comes to your, your pentacles, okay, it's definitely going to benefit you okay so don't think this is something bad no no and also this is going to make you less indecisive i'm feeling so maybe in the past you were like also a little bit stagnated or i'm a little bit indecisive when it came to certain things could be a relationship could be life in general but you're gonna get out of this energy like just look at like how the reading started okay it starts with this two two of swords and the hanged man and like it's literally ending with the three of cups here and also i feel like with the nine of cups coming through you guys there is a great possibility for you to start um or if you're in a relationship you know to really make it a little bit yeah to bring the things a little bit um yeah a, bit, a little bit more serious i'm seeing here if you're dating someone you may actually come into a relationship or if you are um, already with someone things may get a little bit seriouser between you two in a good way though don't worry in a good way but regardless if there was something mentally you know you struggled with something which kept you yeah from sleeping or just something it could be anything okay but you're gonna have a revelation and a realization when it comes to that could be a person could even be a job you know, or even like an exam, it really depends. But whatever it is, it just, it's really going to benefit you. It may come out like very surprisingly, but it will benefit you. I'm seeing this big time. Now guys, let's see what you got when it comes to your vision quest. 
You got the Ace of Air. You got the Five of Water. Ten of Air. Yeah. See, we have loss. We have negative thing. We have fear coming through. Okay. Let's see. Yeah. I am seeing where this is going. Let me make sure everything is like more visible here. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> this is incredible. Aries, a lot of good things are coming your way, okay? A lot of good things. So guys, again, okay? It could be the case that someone communicates to you, you know, something. So you're going to get to know, like something is happening. Someone is may tell you, like maybe something um, regarding to your career or even a relationship or just in general, you know, someone communicates something to you and it's going to break you free from the negativity that's in your life. You know, you have loss, you have negative thinking, you have fear. These are, you even have access, okay? So I feel like these energy, these access energies, you know, which are just holding you back, you're going to be freed from that. This is, you also got the change, right? The true of earth. Like, a balance is needed. And this balance will come through this revelation, through this realization, okay? And it will be a very successful one. Again, I'm seeing that you're not only clearing your energy after that, but you're also then... Something will come for you, a new beginning or a new opportunity, which honestly is going to bring you, like honestly, the breakthrough is really talking through here, you know, and wow, guys, okay, don't worry, it's, it's not something like too world changing or so, but it's something that's very necessarily for you, okay, it's very necessary so you can get out of this negativity you're in, because... Through that, you will definitely be able to start doing what you love or start something new, okay? Maybe there's something you always wanted to do and through that, you can actually make it possible or, you know, you gain the courage for it. Um, yeah, also with the star card coming through here. Yeah, wish fulfillment, you know? But I feel like it's, it's it comes in with a big bang, okay? which is represented with like with the tower card but you you have definitely yeah you have definitely whatever this is about gained um strength and yeah you've gone through something and even if this is just mentally it doesn't matter but guys don't you worry again also with the spiritual warrior coming through you will make it and you will actually have a really beautiful February coming in. It may start off as, you know, a burden. Not, not, not a burden, no, but as something which is pretty heavy. Like maybe, um, a sh like, you're, you're going to be surprised about something, but it's going to free you. I'm seeing this for sure. Yeah, guys, let me know how you feel about this. This is definitely a very interesting energy, Aries. And yeah, if you liked it, like and comment. Also, make sure to subscribe. And yeah, I'm also doing pick a cards. If this is something you would like to see, definitely make sure to stick around. And yeah, I will see you in February then. No, not in February. <laughs> in March. <laughs> yeah, guys, take care.